Sailor to my left, and for my guy KG to my to my next left. I fucked it up a little bit, but we in the building, uh, man. So, <laughs> welcome uh, to the Chop Out, Chop Up Out. Appreciate you drinking a little bit, man. Yeah. Fellas, what's going on, man? We chilling, man. He's working, bro. Everyday grind. Okay. Family label grindhouse. Okay. Grindhouse. That's the name of your label. That's the name of the label. Okay. KG, you 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 started the label, KG? I started it. Me, me and someone really started it. Okay. I came up with the vision, and you feel me? Okay. He helped. Make it bring the life. Got gotcha. Bring it to life, baby. Got gotcha. you. So. Got gotcha. you. Beautiful thing, man. Beautiful yeah. thing. So you created Shout that. Out so much. Shout yeah. out to So Shout out to So Shout out to So much, man. Yes, sir. So far as the label go, you on your label. You rap on your label. Yes, sir. Independent. 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 You know, we trying to, you know, if we run across some distro deals, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying, that help benefit all the artists on the label there, you know, we're going to jump on that. but. As far as it being independent, we all the way with that. That's where the bag at. How many uh, how many guys on the label? Artists, right? See, artists, you got me, Sailor, mm -hmm. um, Hollow, Hollow, I see nice. crazy, okay. and um, the Dage. The Dage. Mm -hmm. Shout out to them, see your team, brother. Yes. Okay. Yeah. So, so Sailor, yes, how long you been on the label, bro? Uh, I just tapped in probably about, it's about to be a, a year now, so tapped in early, you know, August. Okay, early, early August. Yeah. Beautiful thing, man. You are finally yourself a home. Yeah, that's it. That's, that's, that's really it. Real top of the brother. Is. Kind of, that ever since I met that boy, it's been there rocking with him ever since. That's what's up, bro. You know what I'm saying? That's what's up, bro. So, so y'all pretty much do all y'all music, y'all do collab with each other, or how that work? Y'all uh, go outside in it? It depends. Like, um, I feel like now we're trying to just we trying to focus on finding the right sound. Okay. Like, of course you got power plays out there. Like we're looking into some power plays, like working with major artists. But you know, it just gotta be right. It okay. gotta be right. It gotta be the right sound. Like, I'll look at for him, like his music, for instance. Like, I feel like he kind of. Within this year, he got better as an artist. He kind of found his sound, gotcha. and he started like realize like, okay, I don't really just gotta do hip hop. Like I can do pop too. Gotcha. And for the reason why I feel like he's gonna be big is because like, pop that's a whole other lane. No doubt about it. You know what I'm saying? No like about it. a lot of people feel like Flo Rida, for instance. They feel like Flo Rida fell off or something like that. But no, he, he getting paid. He, he paid don't went pop. Yeah, really, he got he gonna have no lower longevity there. Oh, that's what they don't understand about that part level, bro. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? That's a whole different audience, my brother. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Whole nother audience. Wow. Whole so you kind of you kind of mirror a uh, pop artist as well. So your you, you, your level of music, your lane, rather. Yeah, I kind of felt like you know, oh, because I grew up on, on Michael Jackson mm -hmm. a lot, like more than the average, I would say. Right. You know, right. Like I went from watching him on YouTube to tapping into the CDs. Okay. You know, seeing his tours, you yeah. know, Asian tour, that shit crazy. He's a bigger like, than life artists, though, man. Yeah, the bigger nigga life. move an inch, the crowd is going wild. I've seen him, man. He got yeah. a fight out there and shit. Yeah, so, uh, you know, seeing that as such a young kid, I was just like, man, like, you know, that's that's one of the most inspiring things ever. So you sang as well, you know what I'm saying? I still got rap, you okay. know, put it on for the team, you know what I'm saying? That's okay. all the time. Straight, yeah. straight up, man. That's what's up. I really man. feel like the whole team versatile, though. Like, everybody able to do what they do. What they do. They in their lane. Yeah, in their own lane. That's, that's, that's what's got dope. They, they, allowed, they, they allowed to adopt it. You know what I'm saying? Man, it's, it's, they keep it in their lane. That's how you keep a broad spectrum, though. Don't be calling yourself off into one thing. All gangster rappers. You know, uh, all whatever the fuck John Dre really consider yourself in. So, I always look at that like you gotta have a lot of diversity, man. Yeah. You just do, bro. I'ma throw a lot of stuff on the wall. I don't know what's gonna stick. Some gonna stick. Don't take one of us to take off. When we all took off, and one of us took off. I tell my cat that right now. Chuck, Greg, Brown. I tell them that all the time. One of us take off, all of us took off. Cause we gonna open the door. The door open now. Right. You understand what I'm saying? So we gonna create something, create a wave, and everybody can get money behind this shit. You know what I'm saying? So, so bad to you, KG. Brown House, that's the name of the label. Brown House, the love label. The, love the logo. The label, the apparel, the lifestyle. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Brown House really a lifestyle. 
Okay. You know what I'm saying? I feel like everybody in Grindhouse, you know, they got that mentality. Like, I feel like my whole life I've been an underdog. You know what I'm saying? Just okay. being in school and, um, you know, just because you get suspended from school, you fight in school or something like that, you skip, you, you know, you do regular shit, you know what I'm saying? And I feel like the skin color play a big role in it too. Always does. You know what I'm saying? Just the doubt, you know, teachers are saying you'll be dead or in jail for 20 years. You know what I'm saying? I heard that a lot. Because, you know, I, I was a troublemaker. Like, uh, I just felt like I ain't really, I wasn't really that interested. I still got my diploma. Right. But I wasn't really, I felt like school was a waste of time. Gotcha. You know what I'm saying? I felt like it was, that ain't the real, the real way of life. Like, I feel like school is just like something like, just to, you know, once you get past reading and writing yeah. and stuff, like. Most of feel like mama was pushing you. Yeah, that's bullshit. Yeah. They don't teach you the things you really need to do like. I get it, man. I done learned more from life than I did from school. Right, right. So so what inspired the logo, man? I see you got a gorilla on that, man. What what a gorilla signify, man? The gorilla just signify being in beast mode. Okay. Beast mode, you know what I'm saying? I feel like gorillas, they really be chilling. They yeah. really be chilling, but when until you wake them up. Until they wake up. Yeah. They one of the most powerful beasts on the planet. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Uh, great. You know what I'm saying? Uh, and if I felt like if I was an animal, I just, I don't know, like, my inner animal would just say, okay. Okay. That's what's handy, bro. How, how long, how long uh, the label been in existence, man? We just got started really like two years ago. Okay. Two years ago for a while, it was just me. It was just me and um, Soma. Okay. You put along with Soma, also artist? No, nah, he, he like a, he a producer mostly. Okay. Okay. You know what I'm saying? He he did his little he do he do his little thing on some songs. He got some unreleased stuff, but he's mainly like a producer. Gotcha. gotcha. You know what I'm saying? He get a lot of placements. Um, he making a lot of headway, like in the game, and I feel like he can get placements from major artists like real soon. Yeah, you know, straight up, straight up. You always need that guy in the group, man. Gotcha. That's what made Dam and Dad so important to they to they label back then. He was able to get them in places they weren't able to get into. So, yeah. you know, man, we can, you know, we can disregard him in some sense, but yeah. we can't disregard him because he got them in places they weren't able to get into you know, with his mouth. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So can't forget that. Either. You can't, bro. You can't, bro. You can't disregard niggas like that, man. Cause everybody play a position, bro. Mm -hmm. Iron sharp and iron, man. So mm -hmm. that's how that go, man. But as far as uh, studios, man, uh, this guy Somo, uh, he got his own studio. We all record a lot of y'all music at. Yeah, at the studio. At the studio? Yeah. Yo, what's the name of y'all's studio? Grindhouse Studios. Grindhouse Studios. Wow. So y'all 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 do it most of y'all recordings there. Yeah. We try to we try to keep it. Sometimes we will let other artists come and record, but we always just try to keep it in house. I got you. In house. Just give each artist a chance to like express themselves gotcha. and create new sounds. And gotcha. Evolve, you feel me? Cool. So who up next, KJ? Who up next? I feel like the whole team up next. Everybody up next. Everybody up next. I feel like any day, you feel me, anybody can take off. Gotcha. You gotcha. Know, and especially and how internet works. Right. Any females on the label? Just one. Just one? What's her name? As far as the artist, Ladege. Ladege, she a singer or rapper? She mainly, she can, I ain't really hear it. She say she can sing. I got you. You know what I'm saying? I never heard it. Gotcha. But she's mainly like an MC. She okay. She she like the flow. She crazy with the flow. I feel like if she actually, you know what I'm saying, like really implemented the time, you know what I'm saying, the effort into it, she can actually like do something in the industry. Like as gotcha. far as in talent wise. Gotcha. You know what I'm saying? Not gotcha. just me being real. That's thing. what's happening, bro. Man, I like to see young black men, man, doing y'all thing, man, creating, man, and trying to uh, basically get to the bag. Gotcha. Just say that, man. You know what I'm saying? And, Gotcha. Doing something positive, man. You know what I mean? I'm on board with that all day, every day, man. Right. Any mixtapes out there now, right now, that these people can find? I just dropped my album, Rebirth. Rebirth. Yeah. Okay. I just dropped, I just dropped that probably like three weeks ago. Okay. It's doing numbers, too. I was going to ask you that. How's it doing? It's doing numbers. I think the last time I checked it, it was at what? Um, it was at like 130K stream. Oh, wow. Nice numbers, brother. Yeah, How could I, they find it? 
Okay. Everywhere. Everywhere, all platforms. Everywhere except for right now, everywhere except SoundCloud. Okay. Like he's on Spotify, iTunes, YouTube, you know, all of that. So you said it's an album. How many tracks? 17. 17. Oh 17 my God. songs of pressure. Oh, my God, man. That's a huge Impression. fucking body of work. Mm-hmm. Wow. Man, what the people can expect from an album, though, KG? Um, I would just say growth. Mm-hmm. I would say growth because, you know, it's just like I got that one. I'm going to drop again this year, like, we make we make songs, we make a lot of songs every right, week. Right, right, right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so exactly. I can really drop ten albums right now if I wanted to. Right, right, right. That's how crazy the vault is. Right. Even with him too, like he recorded like how many songs? Dang, like a hundred a yeah. hundred and twenty songs in like four months. Oh my god, working. Yeah, just been on his plan. So you know, like, man, you gotta stay consistent, bro. Mm-hmm. Hey, they, Name of the game, bro. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. But uh on that note. Hey, this is the Chop Up Hour. I am Fat Man, and we'll be right motherfucking back. Yo! KG and Sailor in the fucking building, man. Fellas, thank y'all, man, for fucking with me tonight, man, and chopping it up, man, and letting the people know what y'all got going on out here in the universe, man. Appreciate you, man. man. Y'all active, man. Y'all active, y'all young, man. Sky's the limit, fellas. You know what I'm saying? So what's next for you? I know you're just speaking about your mixtape, your album, rather, the the, uh, the album you had dropped. Any mixtapes in your future? Um, yeah, I'm thinking about dropping on um, like another mixtape on um, on my birthday. Okay, when is that? August 28th. Okay. Mm-hmm. okay. I'm thinking about that. But um, I do. I got I got a show coming up on the 24th um, at at the Den. Trapland, yeah, yeah okay. from Trapland Pat. You know what I mean? Okay. That's gonna that's probably gonna be on. Um, the biggest show in Brown. Okay. When is this coming real soon? Yeah, April 24th. April 24th, okay. Okay. And next, and it's next, next month. Saturday. No, it's next week. It's next week. We're April now. God damn, I lost track of time. Yeah, that's what happened when you grind. Though. Yeah, yeah, you lose track of time. Dearly, bro. I swear on God, I do. Save it, man. Back to you, bro. What you got coming up, man? Anything current right now that you got finna drop soon or working on? Uh, May 5th, my tape, Fresh Studio Produce, you know. Mixtape? Yes, sir. What, I mean, EP? Nah, full tape. Full tape. Full showcase. Okay. You know. Like Solo? You got, you got the light there. So I, I got, bet you. I got, I got some people on there. Course, like features. Okay. You know what I'm saying? KG is definitely on there. Okay. You guys on there. And um, Icy's on there. And yeah, 24 song. I mean, 22 song. Yeah, 22, 22 song. 22. That's a huge goddamn body of work, man. Yeah. It's just the showcase. You, so people don't drop, like, people don't put that much. Last time so I saw that was Master P, man. He the last cat I seen do that. He was be lazy. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Hey, so did these, uh, the, 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 these particular albums. No singing on them, none of them. Y'all got anybody singing on them vocally? I'm singing on most of them. You singing on most of them? Singing and rapping, that's why I mm-hmm. say I'm mm-hmm. it's just It's going to be very different from that that type. Like, you know, you singing rap, you know, gotcha. yeah, so it's just, it's, you know, so it's my own work. Gotcha. Just giving it to the world. I'm showcasing myself. All this work I done did. Right, right. Months I put in, you know, I ain't putting that in up. Three months. Okay. Just working. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, locked in the studio. Locked right? in. Don't know no other reason to jump in or nothing. It's that, you know, I just put it into the studio. Straight up, brother. Man, I love the sound of that, man. You niggas act the fire, man. Y'all act up and y'all let it do what it fucking do. You know what I'm saying? That's how you gotta be. Yeah. So you spoke about a show you got coming up soon. This huge show you're working on. 
Mm -hmm. That's uh, April what? Let me say 20, 24th. 24th. What club that was? Club, it's actually at a it's at a wrestling ring. It's at real, real shit. <laughs> yeah. Shout out to that nigga uh Zeus, baby Zeus. Baby Zeus he ain't no rascal, but he's a hand thrower. Shout out to baby Zeus, man. It's my guy, man. That shit going on. He brought a wrestling ring that made me think about baby Zeus the night. Shit, he don't be in that wrestling. I think he would wrestle a nigga, but he got he don't be on the ground for he wrestling. He rather throw hands though. <laughs> Baby Zeus said he'd rather throw hands, but if you get him on the ground, he will wrestle your ass, nigga. That's what it's going to take, you know what I mean? We're going to try to hit you with elbow in the process. You know what I mean? Try to end this wrestling shit. That shit take a lot out of nigga when nigga be wrestling. Had a stimulant like a motherfucker to be with all that wrestling, bro. You got your head down and be like KO your ass. That's bullshit. You got a breath, nigga. You got a gas. So he's a wrestler? Baby Zeus, he's an MMA fighter. Oh, yeah. I'm but he know how to wrestle too, though. When he wrestles, if you get him on the ground, he'll wrestle with you. But technically, he really a hand throw. Okay. Shout out to that nigga out of Daniel Beach, Florida, man. My first MMA fight I had in him. Dope, dope little dude, man. Dope, man. But uh, anyway, man, this about y'all tonight, man. This y'all platform tonight, fellas. Uh, how do you find y'all, man, on the social media world, man? Um, you can find me on all our social media platforms. Man. It's your boy KG, that's I T S Y A B O Y K G. Um I'm on Spotify, iTunes, okay. You can Google me. Okay. You know what I'm saying? I'll pop up. There it is. You know, lit all the way. There it is. Let's get that shit on me. Sailor, what about you, bro? Way in, nigga. You can find me at Sailor Santana X. Um, Sailor. Santana X, you know what I'm saying? I'm on Spotify, Apple, all that. You know, yeah. Hey, same man. thing, same thing. We Ready got to turn it up. That's what's up, man. We got Brian House, motherfucking representative in this bitch KG, man. One of the founders. We got the young nigga Sailor, man, the artist on the label. Man, y'all fuck with us, man. They told y'all how they could find how y'all can find them, man. This is the chop up by you. I am fat, man. This is Bob Walker. The Chopper Bottle's first motherfucking sponsor, man. Black on, man. Vault Vocal, y'all fuck with him, man. The Chopper Bottle, we gone. Yo! Back. All the goals I already done passed All the hoes that I really done had It's a joke when I think about bass Feel lost